Hi you guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Sharice and I'm a mom of two that works full time and attends grad school full time. Today we are going to be stuffing my cash envelopes, sinking funds, and a few savings challenges. So if you would like to see how I divide up my income, stay tuned. So first we will get started with my cash envelopes, blessings is going to get five dollars i'm not going to be stuffing all my envelopes i decided to leave some of the money in the bank my budget is a little crazy right now and i'm just trying to make it as simple as possible eating out is going to get forty dollars after we came back from vacation just um it was crazy with me trying to make sure I paid off my credit card with all the vacation expenses on top of what I already had saved up. Gas is not gonna get anything. I filled my tank up and I just left that in to pay my credit card off in the bank. Groceries, same thing, I'm leaving that um, in the bank and I'ma just pay that off straight from my credit card. Kids, same thing. Household is gonna get $10. So when we came back from vacation, we have to pay that off um you know waiting for the dust to settle from all the vacation purchases and then just going into the holidays birthdays it's been a busy month spending is going to get 30 dollars so yeah with me wanting to just be sure that my card stays at a minimum low or no balance i want to um adjust my spending and budgeting for this month and miscellaneous is gonna get $20. So I will be stuffing less for my sinking funds and some sinking funds might be getting emptied out um, to pay off birthday festivities and things like that. So that concludes my uh, cash envelopes. Let's move on to sinking funds. Okay, so first we are going to start with car maintenance. I'm gonna move this over here. Car maintenance is going to get $10. And car maintenance now has 110, 15, 20, 120. I hope everyone's doing well. Mental health check, let me know how you're doing in the comments. Grass school is gonna get $10. I did have a few days this month where I was kind of down. So, Gasco has 100, 200, 20, 30, 40, 55, 255. Definitely important to, um, you know, practice that self care, check in with yourself, with others. Health is going to get $10. Because um, you never know, this is a tough time of the year for a lot of people so health now has 100 200 300 10 20 35 6 7 what was that 337 yeah right yeah no three yes okay <laughs> so me myself and i as you can see is empty that's one of the ones that got emptied out already it's going to get ten dollars Thing one is going to get $10 as well. Have you guys seen Avatar yet? So let's see. Thing one now has 5,100, And thing two is going to get $10 as well. I have heard the same thing from everyone who has seen it, which is that it is super long. We are planning to go see it. Um, Baby Girl barely made it through Black Panther, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna take her to see Avatar. Um, speaking of, she has 50, 75, 81, two, 82 dollars. We did just celebrate her birthday this weekend. Go ahead and leave her happy birthday in the comments. Vacation is going to get $20. 
Um, but yeah, I'm not sure if taking her is the move. I think that she will need to sit this one out. Um, what else? There are a few movies I want to see, but they come out next year. Beauty is going to get $5. Um, as you guys know, that have been on my channel for a while. By the way, welcome to the new subscribers. I appreciate you being here. Black Friday gets nothing. I am on break from school right now, so I'm catching up on shows, watching movies, just living my life that these professors would not let me live August through this month. Braces is going to get $5 or nothing let me see braces is not going to get anything today clothes is going to get five dollars nice crisp five um some other shows that i have been watching are blood and water on netflix family fun is going to get five dollars that show is about this girl named Pulang. Um, family Fun now has 20, 40, 5, 55, 65, 70, whose sister went missing when she was a baby. She was kidnapped. Gifts is going to get $5. So Puling um, basically finds this girl and she's convinced that this girl is her sister who was kidnapped. So Gifts has 25, 35, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40. Perfect. As you know, it's birthday season in my family. And school days is not getting anything. Support is not getting anything. Let's oops, let's move on to let's move on to our housing binder. So anyway, this show. Oh, by the way. This is my housing binder. This is the binder that I keep my sinking funds in for my future house. It is filled with prop money. All this money is in the bank in my high yield savings account. Um, so yeah, Pulling finds this girl. She thinks it's her half sister. So this, the show is just about that quest to, um, you know, her investigating. First month's bills is capped at $500. Furniture is also... Let me see. No, furniture is getting one dollar. So furniture now has one hundred, two hundred, three hundred, four hundred, five hundred. Oh, guys, this is so hard. Furniture now has one hundred. 200, 300, 400, 500, 520, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 600, 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 622. So yeah, that's a good show. If you've watched that, let me know. Or um, yeah, if you watched it, let me know. And let me know what you thought about it. Groceries is capped at $150, so we are not stuffing that one, actually. Home repairs is going to get $1. The other show that I watched and finished was How to Ruin Christmas. This was a really fun show. There's three seasons. So Home Repairs now has $100, $200, $300, $400, 420 30 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 500, oh, 5, 10, 11, 12. Guys, yeah, this prop money is like hard to grip. But yeah, that's a good one as well. Um, It's just a fun family show. Home Inspection has $500. And it is capped as well as household items, which has $500. Let's move on to our savings challenges. Okay, so on to our investing challenge. Today, I'm going to be doing $16. I'm doing $2 a day. So $16, that's going to be eight days. So let's go.
so we are on the 18th i'm a little behind like i said it's been a crazy month the next stuffing i'm hopefully planning to go ahead and finish this and i will try to do that extra 20. i've been able to do the extra 20 every month um for those that are not familiar with this challenge it's through mommy trader you um pick a stock each month they usually pick a stock together and then you can also find twenty dollars minimum in your budget and build up on one of your current positions so a position that you already bought it's a great challenge for beginner investors i love it and i appreciate her so much for putting this together for us so um yeah usually i put the extra in here i do transfer this directly to my brokerage from my account i don't take this money out the bank but as i find the extra 20 in my budget i usually keep it in here um but not today so as far as this challenge as i mentioned in my last video um i'm technically done with it i should have did this extra house down here but pretty much um my goal was to fill in all these houses and then do these two you know as an extra challenge so um this month i decided to take a break from this challenge just because like i said birthdays holidays vacays just all the things i don't want to be stressing over trying to you know make my budget work so i just decided to keep my 500 for now i'll just go ahead and finish this probably in january but um yeah so far i do have twelve thousand dollars which i can go ahead and count for you so i have five thousand ten thousand eleven thousand and twelve and um yeah that was my goal for this year so i'm pretty proud of myself that's awesome next we have this five hundred dollar challenge which is my daughter's this is for my daughter's brokerage i'm gonna go ahead and just use this dark pink or i don't know what this is but anyway she's gonna get ten dollars each heart is worth ten that's pretty close and yeah it's gonna total 500 so yeah i am enjoying my break from school i'm also about to be on vacation from work spend some time with the kids um let me know your favorite christmas movie i know we talked about it a little before you guys shared some good ones um, I'm gonna count this next time because I'm gonna be finished. So yeah, let me leave this in here for now. My favorite Christmas movie is This Christmas. And for my other daughter, I'm gonna do 10 as well. Um, and then there's some other movies that I don't know if they're Christmas movies. Like I know I mentioned Nightmare Before Christmas last time, we watched that. Um, look who's talking now the movie with john travolta and where the dogs are talking i like that one um i think it happens around christmas um but yeah let me know some of your faves because i'm trying to watch some stuff or anything any shows that i can watch while i'm on break that you recommend definitely let me know so that's going to conclude my video for today thank you guys so much for watching again welcome to the new subscribers i so appreciate having you here um i'm probably going to have another giveaway coming up soon so definitely stay tuned make sure you are tuned in subscribed liking commenting all the things um and yeah until next time bye